How's everyone doing today? <clears throat> I'm a little horse. I'm on spiritual warfare. Right now they're hitting me with electromagnetic radiation as I have been posting on several videos. You know, it's really a shame when people who are trying to kill us, we have no one to go to. Um, then when we try to defend ourselves, we're committing a crime. But it's okay for people to try to kill us. Namely, the government. Hmm. Somebody just called me. And for some reason, my phone is turned up. But I'm not getting the rings. So they are playing on all my phones. You know, trying to stop any communication or truth that I tell. <clears throat> now, my question to them is, it says sound, so it's not on vibrate, but why am I not getting my calls, my rings? Who are my calls going to, government? Are you getting my calls? Because you're the one who keeps harassing me. You... Plano, McKinney, Dallas, state of Texas. Why don't you speak the truth for once? Tell the people what is going on and why you are attacking me with Lockheed Martin weapons. No offense. Maybe I need to cut that. Because that's all they're doing is watching everything I do and say find a reason to um, zap me, trying to shut me up, but yet and still you're surrounding my home in your little private aircraft, whoever you, you authorized or gave your weapons to, Department of Defense. You've kept me up till four o'clock this morning so that's why I'm, I'm, I'm a little sleepy right now. Eyes getting low. Another thing that keeps happening, unless my sister just called me, is, uh, in fact, let me just turn this off, restart it, and maybe I can get my volume back or get my calls back. You know... I wouldn't have to get out here and do anything or say anything, but God had a plan for me. And I have so many women and men who are, don't even know me that are just following other people, right? And getting a little kick out of seeing me suffer while they torture me with uh, d the Department of Defense's weapons. Uh, I have to say that because they're owned and operated by them. But it's okay, right, YouTube? For them to aim weapons at us and you don't allow us free speech to defend ourselves. It's got to be, uh, we're violating the guidelines and stuff like that. But I guess that happens when you're aiding and abetting people to try to shut someone up or shut someone down or possibly kill them because they speak the truth. This is my um, Daughter of Zion account phone that I use for Daughter of Zion. Of course, they get a hold of every number that I get since they own everything. It's really a shame that people can commit hate crimes against women 
children, black women, even the pale-faced women, because if you're aiming weapons at them, you're hating against them as well. And men. And no one does anything about it. Again, if we try to speak about it, it gets shut down. We're violating. Well, we wouldn't be out here if you weren't violating us. Amen. Amen. You get to violate us, but we don't get to violate you in defense of you violating us. <laughs> you get my drift. For one thing, I'm sick of Plano, Collin County, always going after my child, my only child, in an effort to... Um, but you know that's what the devil do, but in an effort to hurt me or make me bogged down with what they did to him, which was mind controlled him, V2K'd him, drugged him, falsely accused him. But he's always the guilty one. Really? So you call me today asking if I want to have anything to do with what you guys are plotting. Huh. Look like I say a, a orb in the back. Those are my spirit guides. They watch over me. Poor Nazis. And abroad. That's why you haven't been able to take me out. Because I have my spirit guides with me protecting me. Now, I'm really learning about this stuff because I never indulge in um, not the the spirit guides. That's what I'm talking about. Not the spirit. I've always been in the spirit and I always had a discerning spirit even growing up. Um, what I'm not going to do, though, is tolerate people trying to torture me in a home and I don't exercise my Second Amendment rights to defend myself by the same methods that they are aiming at me. You know. Oh, I see another one. You know, uh, lasers, ray guns. How long are y'all going to torture women, America, and not allow us to defend ourselves against men and possibly women, which I'm pretty sure it is, a bunch of witches, you know. I sit in my home, I mind my business, I take care of my sister, and I have to deal with an army full of uh, witches, warlocks, wizards, whatever they're trying to do. But whatever you're sending to me, I send it back a hundredfold. Since you've been messing with me 31 years now. Behind God. Tell the truth. That's the only reason why you aiming weapons, electromagnetic radiation. The active denial system, you know, the ray gun. If I'm infringing on anyone's copyrights, it's my bag, but I'm just telling the truth. But a, a lot of people rather hear a lie than, than the truth. So I would rather hear the truth because the truth make you free in Christ. And time is winding down. Because anytime scripture that is written that is being fulfilled whether you believe it or not. It is time to get your house or heart in order with God. That's what I call the house, the heart. Because we each got to go before him individually. Now, whether your government wants to tell you these things or not, they will have to answer to God. Okay? But I'm going to continue to do 
the will that God had planned for me. Because that's the will that I'm doing, whether you believe it or not. I'm not here to make anyone believe anything that comes out of my mouth. Because it's really my belief that matters in Christ. Do I believe what he revealed to me? Yes, I do. Otherwise, America and abroad, why are you surrounding me in a variety of aircrafts, including helicopters? Why are you aiming weapons? Why are you keep harassing, stalking, spying? Why do you keep trying to find something against me? I'm, I'm not doing nothing to nobody. But what I'm having to do as a woman and a black woman is defend myself like my ancestors had to do. Because anyone that, that sets out and plots and conspires to hurt another person maliciously is not in their right mind and need mental help. In fact, coming against God, you ain't you're not in your right mind, thinking you can overpower him. I heard a jet right up here, up above my house just now, and now I'm getting stunned right here. So I gotta take my little brush, brush this little device that they're trying to stick on my arm off. Let me see if my sister called me. She didn't call me earlier and, and it kept going to voicemail. So I don't know if the devil, you know, and all on my niece phone too. I mean, what are you doing? You're trying to spawn us because you don't want to pay up. It's not about money to me, America. I'm not about fame or fortune. I don't care a shit about that. What I do care about are people's souls. That's what I care about. I'm already rich. And whatever you're trying to block or stop or torture me or kill me behind, I just seen, I'm just looking at several orbs, is not going to work. Until God says it's time. Okay. He's going to allow me to finish whatever he purposed and prophesied. What he spoke. And I'm trying to get me to spend my money again on your lies. Plano and McKinney. Collin County. You can forget that. You messed him up. He belongs to you. Stop trying to push him on me. Because when I had him, he was drug free. When you had him, somehow drugs ended up in his system. So you plotted and set out to destroy him. He belongs to you. Since he was 17, that's when you took over. 16, you know, when you started the plotting. So he belongs to you, so stop messing with me about something that you did that you gotta now deal with. Because the ball game, the old methods of hurting people and going after our children maliciously, falsely, is not going to hunt with me anymore. You pushed me more into Christ than you ever imagined. I'm more powerful because of you. Now, I'm warning you to leave me alone. Because I'm... <laughs> 
You already know I can get rid of your little witchcraft just by speaking or by moving my hand. Whether people want to believe that or not, I really don't care. Because I know the power that God has bestowed upon me. Now, people can talk about me. They can say all kinds of things. They can make up fake accounts pretending to be me. You'll never be me. You'll never have the things that God blessed and rewarded me with spiritually. No one that I know of. I've never known God to give two people the same gift. Maybe the same um, methods of relaying their gift, such as teacher, preacher, prophet, prophetess, you know. But there are many fakes out here. Many fakes. And all I can say is y'all better use a discerning spirit. Because first of all, you're being taught the commandments of men's traditions and doctrines, like God says in Mark 7. Huh. Is that what your doctrine is? America and abroad to fight women and mess up children. Huh. I'm really chewing this gum, huh? <laughs> My mouth is dry because I'm on a fast today and I really don't tell anybody what I'm doing, but since they're out looking all in my house and being nosy, some battles call for fasting. I admit I don't pray like I used to, but I pray within my mind because the devil is all up in my house hearing everything I say. So I become wiser to not to speak a lot of things out. Because as long as he doesn't have my mind, he can't control it or hear my thoughts, what I say unto our Father. Now again, people can talk about me, people can try to imitate me, duplicate me, try to make out like the things that are happening in my life is not real, but the devil is a liar. Otherwise, why are you, Department of Defense government, aiming weapons at a retired senior citizen and a disabled veteran? Am I at your house spraying over it, calling it climate change? Y'all can say what y'all want to to try to defame my character and insult my intelligence. But guess what? I didn't care then and I don't care now because I know who and whose I am in Christ. And thanks to you, it put me on my knees. <laughs> in the 90s you know you know what you did when you found out about me in 91 because i'm sure that's when you did you came after me in 92 you probably i think you went after my son in 91 all the plotting all the conspiring i'm not a conspiracy theorist i am a fact theorist spiritual and carnal no one is ever going to define me or distort my character. If you do, I will set the record straight, America. And you have your army. But trust me, I got mine. Didn't you see all my angels covering my crown chakra that you have been burning and hitting me in my head? Trying to read my mind. You see it? There go another one. My army is protecting me. Satanists. Fake Zionists. So all of your little spending all your money to 
because I intimidate you because of the knowledge and because of who I am in Christ. It's really a waste of time. And you already know <laughs> that you lost. Have I bowed yet? Have I broke yet? All you little um all I all I can say, all you people who are jealous of me, if any. I know there are people that are envious of me because if not, they wouldn't be plotting to kill me like they did Christ. He didn't do nothing either. He just went and told the truth about who he was. Just like I'm telling the truth about who God says I am. I can't ch say who I'm not because you don't believe or you have unbelief in the very word leaders, church leaders, that you, you profess to believe in but yet and still, you don't believe when God sends someone anointed, because I'm definitely anointed, you know, staggering, drunk, sharing what the Spirit of the Lord has done like he advised. Yeah, there are times where we don't say nothing. I've been there, done that. This has been a very long journey for me. To be exact, 67 years come July. For all you people that think you know me or send your little investigators to come back and tell you lies about me, I've been nothing but a helper to people, even as a teenager. I'm not saying they didn't help me too. Yes, they did. But I've always gave to people. <laughs> to God, I had to say, don't, don't give them. And you have nothing left, you know, so I had to learn that. I would give. And, you know, but I give 